Welcome to the Ohio Ram Show. Well, I'm Craig Thompson, and uh, I'm at West Lafayette, Indiana, and uh, I guess a quote-unquote veteran to ultra cycling. And uh, I was recently at the Texas Time Trial in Glen Rose, Texas. It was really nice. The considering it was Texas uh, that time of year, the temperature was around you know lower to mid 80s, and surprisingly the humidity was was quite acceptable. So the conditions were good. Uh, fairly windy. There's a northeast wind, um, but you know a decent part of the the, the course was sheltered, and uh, it was it was nice. Very hilly course. Um, I've not done this course before. I I was familiar with the Calvin's Challenge and was sort of planning on doing it this year, but it didn't happen. So uh, I went down to Texas and uh, it was a good opportunity to see my parents. They live in Oklahoma. So I uh, drove through, grabbed some some uh, prepared snacks that my mom and sister made. And me and my buddies went down to Texas and rode in a circle for a long time. But uh, the course was good. The tarmac was really nice. The organizers did a really good job with uh, support vehicles. Uh, it was well patrolled on the course. It was a 26-mile course, and there was a um, self-service station around mile 11, uh, so with the, with the restroom and some uh, drink and food. So it was really nice, uh, and I think it was uh, I think probably around 40 or 50 maybe plus people. There's several different races with 6, 12, 24 hours plus a 500-mile event, so quite a few different people doing different things on the course at the same time, and uh, it was really well run. I did about 315 miles, a little bit of change there. Um, it was good. It started at 5 p.m. Uh, the pro, because I initially planned on riding 24 hours straight. Uh, I think the the kink in my plan, I came the day of. I should have probably come the day before and sleep, because uh, around probably 3 or 4 a.m. I realized uh, I was basically asleep on the bike. Uh, so I was trying to ride off the road, trying to cross the center line, and, and so I told my crew it's probably a good time to stop and <laughs> take a nap. And so uh, we had a hotel room right there and pulled off, slept for about an hour and a half, got back on. And uh, again, it kind of kind of changed the complexion of, of uh, what the plans were, but uh, obviously it was, wasn't safe to keep going, but it was good. We had a good time. We learned a lot. And uh, like I said, my, I think our plans talking to my crew, we're looking at doing raw next year and uh, see how that goes. Yeah. We talked a bit. I, I sort of gone back and forth between just, um, going and doing more like the, the crits, you know, a little bit, obviously there's no crew. It's a local, it's a lot easier. And, and I'm certainly uh, the style of a cyclist that can do okay in crits. And my son's also in the junior division. So he's been doing some, uh, we actually could do some races together in cat five or stay with the ultra cycling. So uh, it, it's, it gets really dicey <laughs> with a, a very busy job and two kids who are also quite busy in their, their activities to get the training in and do the, the long rides on weekends. But uh, I think we're gonna try raw. I think it's, it's, it's doable, um, knock on wood, but we'll see how it goes. This is Craig Thompson reporting for the Ohio Ram Show. This is Gregory Zuber, thanking you for watching and sharing. Music by Kevin McLeod.